Well, it's official. Joe Burrow is transferring from Ohio State. Joe Burrow, quarterback, transferring to LSU. Joe Burrow has decided to come to Baton Rouge. He's a good athlete. He's a good leader. The team is bought into. It's going to be exciting to see. Big by Burrow and a deep strike and an open receiver. Jamar Chase, another touchdown. They bring a blitz. Is this the record tire? And it's the 44th touchdown pass of the season for Jimmy Burrow's son Joe to tie the SEC record. Takes a shot and he's got Thaddeus Moss. The tight end down to the 20 yard line. On first and second down. Chase on turns the corner, can't get there, and Eagles catches it and keeps his feet. Brandon Eagles then to the end zone. Touchdown, Texas. Burrow fires and it's caught by Justin Jefferson for the touchdown. Pick up of 18, Burrow. Burrow, aim in end zone, and it gets through, and into the hands of Terrace Marshall. A 14-yard strike. Pocket holds, another end zone shot. LSU looks unstoppable. Against Vanderbilt, Burrow set a new team record with six scoring strikes. Burrow to throw, going up top, looking toward the end zone, passes, caught! We need to be one of the best quarterbacks in the country. If we want to reach our goals, finish number one in the country instead of number six, I need to be up there with Trevor Lawrence. And play it fast in the red zone. Burrow zips it across the middle. Caught. Touchdown, Jamar Chase. He captured this team by leadership, by example, by the toughness. In college football, and here's his son going deep for another touchdown. Derek Dillon. 37 yards, and that's number three. Biggest takeaway. A lot of points. Points. A lot of offense. to chase, 29 to chase, and now Burrow going to the corner for the home run ball, got it, touchdown, Terrace Marshall. Week two against Texas and LSU scores 45, you could have said, okay, but Texas may not be great, let's see. Right. So then it became, all right, well, they're putting up gaudy numbers, but they've beaten Vanderbilt and Utah State. Division, conference, and national title implications on the line. Three tackles. Jerry Judy in motion to the top of your screen on first down from the 29. Play action. Kind of a low all day to throw. And he's got to complete to Henry Rooks. Out to midfield. One play, one first down. Out Najee Harris. A little hesitation. The high step down the sideline. Two huge plays to open things for the Crimson Tide. Empty backfield. Third down goal. Pressure coming. Time to the has to scream to the line. He's going to run on that bad angle. Lost the football. And LSU's got it. Burrow steps up. Deep middle. Got his man again. It's Jefferson. Play fake to Edward Zelaya. Burrow going for Arlovin. And Rosenberg's punt goes back to the 23. Wow! I don't know how Waddle got away from that whiplash. And now he's coming the other way. Jalen Waddle across midfield. He's got a convoy. Waddle, he's gone. Touchdown! Here's an opening. Paris Marshall is gone. 
Touchdown, LSU! He was wide open. Sets up, fires to the end zone. Edwards, Elair, touchdown. I think I want to make sure that we know is this wasn't our goal this year. We got we got more goals ahead of us. This, we, didn't, we didn't go into the season and say we were, we're going to go beat Alabama. You know, we got we got more things ahead of us. Joining us right now, Joe Burrow. Hey, Joe, as uh, you look at the, your season at LSU, kind of talk us through it, because I don't think anybody necessarily had you where you are, but you guys have dominated this year. It's been pretty impressive. Yeah, you know, I don't think anybody did except for the people in this building. And, you know, we we knew what we had. Our offense makes – Coach Owen and I kind of took a chance on each other. You know, I hadn't played football in three years. Nobody nobody knew the, the kind of player that I was. And he, he took a chance on me. games we've had people try to say well wait until dot dot and nobody has stopped Burrow, what impressed me the most was the big games there were five opponents that finished in the top 10 when the season ended against those five opponents joe burrow had 22 touchdown passes and zero interceptions and when the pressure was on he was always at his best and as a starting quarterback Pressed a little bit early, trying to live up to the hype. Settled down the second half of the season. It's only thrown one interception in the last seven. And Stingley, the top freshman corner in the nation. Free play, and it's caught downfield. Ross, after the LSU defense had jumped offside, Lawrence makes the most of the free play. Play action, zips it across. Catch made by Brady Galloway, and the Tigers tight end off and rumbling. Second down. Barnes has still got it. He's got a stand up touchdown. And the Clemson Tigers draw first blood in the Superdome. Well, Troy, he's got that it factor. You know, many have tried, but Joe was the only one to succeed to come to Baton Rouge and to galvanize all the talent that LSU had down there. Very short. <laughs> yeah. But very effective. Now Burrow going to launch downfield for Chase. Who's got it? Touchdown, LSU. Picked up, and now Burrow is launching downfield, and it's Chase again, he's got the catch, and again, fighting inside the five, Terrell is beating it. One of those big four-point plays, Burrow to get a run, escapes and scores. Linde Dixon on the reverse, it's Higgins, Lawrence throws a block, Higgins is off and running. Breaking tackles, banging off people, touchdown. Clemson stretches the lead, wow. Burrow from the pocket, launches to the end zone, cut, touchdown chase. And LSU takes its first lead He's tonight. one of those guys who can just move subtly by time, keep his eyes down the field. Burrow takes off and gets in the clear. Gets a block. Makes a cut and is knocked out at the five. That's gutsy without a timeout, but it works. It sure is. He's got that internal clock. If he's drawing it's out, that's it 2.5. Comes pressure. Gets it out quickly. Dives down. That is Moss just standing still. And LSU stretches the lead before halftime. Lawrence, they pick up the pressure, tries to scramble free. They grab his face mask. It'll be an LSU penalty. He's going to be knocked down. Etienne again. Must
muscles. Touchdown, Clemson. Well, you fake it to him, Burrow. Wanting to throw downfield, now just buying time. Still scampering around and delivers a throw to Moss. And the tight end makes another big play inside the Clemson 40. Randy's kids having a night. Bring it. Burrow's got time. Launching for the end zone. He did win the Heisman Trophy in a landslide, most first place votes, widest margin of victory we've ever seen. Trey, I'll tell you a story. We were walking this to midfield for the national championship game. It was me and Joe side by side against Clemson. He simply looked at me and gave me a wink. He's confident, not cocky. Flushed again, has room, makes it cut, pays the price, lost the ball. Forrest coughs it up at the end of the run. LSU's got the football, and they got one hand on the trophy. Perfect season, national championship. As they say in the Bayou, les it up on Tom Roulet. Let the good times roll. As a young man, he's going in a grown man's locker room and trying to win that locker room. They want to know, your quarterback, can you score? You just talked about he had the touchdown record in the FBS. They want to know, can you win? They went 15-0 and and he won the Heisman Trophy. And they want to know, can you lead? He led his team to a national championship. National championship trophy, Coach Ed Ogeron and the LSU Tigers. All right, guys, great job. We appreciate that. Look, every year when the draft rolls around, there is a resurgence of energy from fans across the NFL because they believe this will be the year their team will make the right selection that will turn the tide and give their franchise and that fan base the hope they've been missing. With the first pick in the 2020 draft, the Cincinnati Bengals select Joe Burrow, quarterback. He's a guy who can do many, many good things, and he's a very diverse quarterback. Well, we all knew this was coming. Doesn't make it any less powerful. Joe, you were in Nashville last year for the draft. If I had said to you then, you're going to be number one overall in 2020, what would you have said? I would have told you you were crazy. It's a dream come true. Mel Kuyper shared earlier that going into last season, he had a sixth-round grade on you, but then you won the Heisman. A national title, your number one Cincinnati overall. As the Bengals look for the first win of the Joe Burrow era. That's a daylight. Hurdles to the end zone. In for the score, and he took a lick from Miles Jack. Great job. But he hung up. Hey, they can't stop us. That's not good. Only people that can stop us is ourselves. On third and nine, Colts bring pressure. They don't do that a lot. Hearing it for T. Higgins on the sideline, and a fingertip grab, and Higgins striding towards the goal line. Burrow this time protected as time. Oh, outside the city, that it is going. Burrow from the gun, this time protected to the end zone. Is it caught? Yes, it is. And the Titans defense get off the field here on third five. Burrow flushed out. Ball with the defense, which is throwing up towards the side. Oh, goodness, was it a catch? Yes, it was. Higgins. Two of Burrow comes up in the slot. Burrow protected. Flushed out. Surveys the defense. Fire. And it's caught. First down. Sidelines the last four plays now is back onto the field for Washington. Second and goal. Play action from Burrow. Throws near side and he's caught. A.J. Green for the Cincinnati touchdown. And this impressive Cincinnati offensive start. The streak is alive. Bad news for Cincinnati fans. Oh, Joe Burrow was bent sideways. It looked like his left leg. Oh, no. The number one pick in the draft looks to be seriously hurt, grabbing at his left leg.
Burrow was on pace to break the rookie records for passing yards, passing attempts, completions, fewest interceptions by a player with over 500 attempts. He was on, on pace to have one of the great rookie seasons. Welcome back to Cleveland as we continue. The Cincinnati Bengals have made their pick. Roger Goodell will be coming out to announce it shortly. I think if we take a look at this, you will see how desperately they need help on the offensive line, Booger McFarland, to keep their young quarterback safe. Greedy, if they don't draft an offensive lineman, they're committing malpractice. The last time we saw Joe Burrow, his knee was going the wrong way. You have to protect your franchise quarterback. They have to take an offensive line. With the fifth pick in the 2021 NFL Draft, the Cincinnati Bengals select Jamar Chase, Wow. Wide receiver, LSU. Wow, you mentioned the partnership with Joe Burrow. They become the first teammates. Quick snap, Burrow with a look. And zone throw! Going deep, Jamar Chase! He's got it! Chase to the end zone! for Cincinnati and going deep into the end zone and caught by Chase! Oh my goodness, what a crab! 34-yard touchdown throw! Burrow runs it himself, repaired knee and all and a block by his college teammate Jamar Chase. First and goal. Reef the block, Williams the block to the end zone, touchdown! It's Jamar Chase with his second today. Nine-yard strike, and the Bengals build their lead. Blake locked down to three, two. Snap away. Open for the touchdown. What a grab by Chris Evans, and that's going to be a Bengal touchdown. They do. Burrow for Chase. He's got it, Jamar Chase. He's unstoppable in the last two minutes of a half. What a big yes. delay. Nixon is in. Burrow to throw. Ends up. Touchdown, Cincinnati. C.J. Uzama. And Burrow with a first and ten. Nixon in the backfield, and he's hit off right out of the blocks that time by Washington. And a big-time hit in the secondary with the completion. Out to the 41 yard line. It's a gain of 10. Got to be able to cover it. We bring those, those good people up. Underneath it's Nixon. Second goal at the nine. Diving in. Touchdown. He got it. Looks at that timeout. They've got two left in Seattle. Timeouts. Blocked by Williams. Going deep. Double team. Higgins has got the ball. At the five. That was spectacular! 52-yard reception to the three! That's holding up for Baltimore. Blocked by Nixon, touchdown Higgins. And he beats Seymour. One-yard touchdown throw. And the third touchdown pass in the first half for quarterback Joe Burrow. Approaching 200 yards of total offense. Lawrence keeps it again! Dives, touchdown! We had we had a we had a bunch. Like it's gonna break the dam. We're gonna look back when this night's over. We're gonna have 400 yards of offense. On and he is playing well tonight. Looked like a busted play as downfield pass is caught. Chenault. Lawrence is short. And the Bengals get the stop they needed. Stop for me to take over. If we hadn't turned the ball over so much, take care of it here. Burrow floats it, Chase downfield, got him. Hit him in stride, and that's what the Bengals needed. Burrow keeps, flips, Uzama. A move, and a touchdown. Complete first.
first down inside the 10. And the Mixon picks his way. And just short of a touchdown. Mixon got it. Thank God. That's what I'm talking about. That's what I'm talking about. Let's go. Lawrence. Time running out. Looks for Agnew. Did he get both feet down? Wow. And he did. What a catch. Robinson. Get back out of it. Flag on the play. Pass is caught. Uzama. Touchdown. And his ability, his ability to walk in the huddle and have the other 10 guys look at him and know that we have a guy that has supreme confidence. Not cockiness, but just confidence. Lawrence spins away. Downfield and short. Joe Burrow gets the ball in a tie score. Come on, Joe. Let's go. We're on the clock out. We're going to kick a field goal. Get us some field goal range. Let's go. Mean, nasty, Let's tough. Go, Let's go. go. Uzama. There he goes. Down inside the 25. Well, to me, it's just the poise that he plays with. I, I look at accuracy, poise, decision-making, playmaking, and Joe Burrow's off the charts in all four of those areas. Bengals have never led tonight. Cincinnati wins it 24-21, and the rookie is hoisted for the second time. No colors anymore, I want them to turn back. It just well, gets better, bro, I promise. Keep going, bro. Keep going. Good job, good job today. The things worth having, you got to go get them and, and not wait for someone to give them to you, and I thought that's what our guys did today. Cincinnati, with a win, would take the AFC North. First ever matchup between the homes. Joe Burrow, first of I'm sure will be some high profile meetings for years to come. The Kansas City Chiefs have a 14 0 first quarter lead. Second and seven. He's able to plant it. One on one coverage down deep. And it is knocked down at the last moment. Oh my goodness. Hill had it and Bell just batted it out of his hand. Go. Wide open. It's Chase. Chase. There is no chase. It's a touchdown. Nobody's going to catch him in the open field. 69 yards to go with a 72-yarder in the first quarter. Nelson Redmond. McKinnon comes into the game. The running back. And look at the open space as Mahomes slides all the way out to about Six the Six third down attempts. They got to pick up nine. Pass. Almost intercepted. Pringle prevented it with a great turnaround offense to defense. First down, Burrow airs it out to Higgins with the catch right over Fenton. Have not led at any point in this game. Burrow to the end zone. Now they do. Touchdown, Cincinnati. Timely call right there. Throw it to someone quickly. Here comes the pressure. He just has to unload it. And that pressure. 
and now you got to bring out Butker. Comes it on the hold, and the kick by Butker is good. And we've got matching 31s on the board. Pick up the pressure this time and go deep. An incomplete Fenton knocked it away from Higgins. Pick up some of that yardage to make it a simpler kick. You, they're coming after you. You got to throw it right away. You do score a touchdown here. You throw it. Put it up. Chase has it. They got the one on one right over Ward. The aggressive nature of the Chiefs. Over the holder. Straight away from 20 yards. Pearson. The kick is good. And the Bengals have won the AFC North. Talk about the jungle! Welcome to the jungle! They're back, the Bengals won the division. Kansas City drops possibly the number one yeah. seed. Yeah, 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 yeah